Motorola CEO apologizes for their Cyber Monday disaster. Apple may be looking into 4K displays on the next iPad, and HTC finally sees some light in between some other additional darkness. I'm Jaime Rivera, and trust me, Motorola CEO, I want a free phone, not apologies. This is Pocket Now Daily. Let's start today off with some official news from HTC, which are both good and bad. On the good side, their revenue is up 3% compared to last month, which is great since they haven't really had an economical break in probably a year already. It's been really bad for them, but sadly on the bad side, if you want to get the HTC One Mini in the UK, you're out of luck as the phone is currently banned for patent infringement from Nokia. So you thought that the company would get a break, but they really haven't. Now let's talk about Apple as the company is reportedly working with five different prototypes of that 12.9 inch iPad that they're apparently working on, which is interesting. But even more interesting is the fact that apparently we're not just going to get one 12.9 inch iPad. Apparently Apple is working on bringing us two different tablets, and it seems that one of them will retain the current render display resolution, which is 2048 by 1536, which is close to 2K. And then apparently the other tablet will have 4K resolution. It's really interesting how Apple plans to bring this to the table with all their iOS uh, you know limitations but stay tuned let's see how that goes and for those of you that are interested in a better camera experience on your current Nexus 5 or any Google edition phone well it seems that the company is already testing Android 4.4.1 in the crowd so this could mean that the update is very close to being released and that's actually a big deal as probably one of the biggest enhancements that everybody's waiting for is enhanced camera technology now obviously we still don't have any specific dates this could take a couple of weeks but stay tuned it's worth it and speaking of Google companies, Motorola CEO Dennis Woodside just issued a public apology for their Cyber Monday disaster. As it turns out, they were selling the Moto X at $349 and their Moto Maker website just went ballistic. It crashed. It could not take even half the orders that they were receiving on demand and they just couldn't figure it out. And as it turns out, they are offering a consolation of starting this deal again on December 9th. Now, links in the description for details on how to apply to that, but it's really interesting to see that the Moto Moto X is making a dent, even though cheap. And finally, for the interesting news of the day, the Cyber Monday deals results are in and, well, laugh. It turns out that the company that had the worst deals ever is the one that sold the most. And this is Apple. They always have the most terrible deals and they sold more software and hardware than anybody. And we're talking more about the iPad. And yeah, the iPad Air had a lot to do with that. But, you know, that leads you to the question of the day. What did you buy for Black Friday or Cyber Monday? What is your new acquisition? In my particular case, I had to exercise some restraint as I actually have too many gadgets right now, but leave us a comment down below. What did you buy? And friends, you know the drill. If you want to get the news earlier before this video is filmed, make sure you follow us on pocketnow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can also follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We will see you tomorrow.